Okay, hi. Hi guys. So today I video Deb while she was playing. Yeah. Uh, she, uh, she's the one who I keep mimicking her and posting her videos but through me. And now we are going to interview her and listen to her story because she's my successful story <laughs> of living healthy. Okay, hi Deb. Hi. Okay dear, now I want you to tell us about yourself. Everything about you. Let's start with your name and your age because this is important. Okay. <laughs> Here it's okay to say it because okay. you look so young oh, and thank so you. beautiful. Thank you very much. All right. Well, my name is Deb Hernandez Osborne. I am married. I've been married for 38 years. Wow. I have a son who is 30 years old. I have a granddaughter who wow. is 20 months old. I have a Rottweiler named Kuma that I love. Um, I have been in the fitness industry since 1977. Yeah. Um, wow. Yeah, a long, long time. So I've been teaching for 40 years. I started off, uh, I just, you know, I saw an ad in a newspaper for a Lane Powers Fitness Clubs back in 1977. And um, I needed to move to Philadelphia because I fell in love with a musician, which I married, and um, I wanted to move here. So I had always been involved in, very active in school, so I thought it would be the perfect job. And um, so I started in 1977, working for Elaine Powers, as I said. And then um, in 1985, I went out on my own and I opened up my own gym. And um, it was fabulous. And I had my gym up until 18 years ago. So that would have been, I guess, right around 2000. 2000, and that's when I closed my gym and came to LA Fitness with a group of people whom I absolutely love. I still teach for them. Um, it's hard to leave, you know, I think like now it's probably time for me to retire and I go away. I don't think so, I don't think anyone <laughs> but will leave you. I just love this group of people so much and I love fitness um, I can see that. that I just can't give it up yet. So I'm not quite ready yet, but no, 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 no. Um, that's kind of where I am in life. And how old are you? I am 60 years old. Wow, Deb! <laughs> I can't believe Hard to believe. Look, I know. Look it's so, such a big so, number. So, no, yeah, just forget. It's just a number. Just really, a number. it's just a number. So, what you're doing exactly, other than the fitness, because we saw that you are very energetic. How you are getting your energy? How? What you do with your? Okay. Well, your you know, daily. Okay, my daily. Well, fitness is, you know, a huge part of my life. Um, it's a way of life for me. Not only has it been my career, I just love it. I enjoy it. I love to be fit. But yeah. um, there's other things that I love. I love spending time with my granddaughter. I love my animals. Um, I love gardening. I have a greenhouse, so I spend a lot of time gardening. I love cooking. This is your peace of mind. This, this is, is the peace of mind that you're bringing to yourself, which exactly. is stress-free. Yes. Plus the playing, it is actually stress-free too. Yeah, yeah. I'm just, you know, I'm really laid back. I'm really mellow. That's at this good. time in my life, I only want to do what I enjoy doing, and what I love to do, and that's fitness, my animals, my grandbaby, my gardening, and my cooking. That's pretty much me. Wow, you can too. <laughs> yeah, I love to cook. That's, that's yeah. great. I that's love it. Because I, I keep saying, now we have to go back and cook at home. Yes. We have to cut eating outside and start yeah. eating home. Well, my favorite, and cooking favorite thing is gardening. So you have to And access. eating what I grow. Okay, <laughs> that's what great. I grow. That's yeah. really great. Yeah. Okay, tell me what do you grow. Oh geez! This is our every year, step. every year the garden gets a little bit bigger. So of course, tomatoes and cucumbers and peppers and green beans and hey, eggplant. You have your vegetables. And all you have your, your herbs. Own vegetables. Yeah. Is it organic? Uh, is well, it's organic as my don't. backyard can be. I guess. <laughs> I guess so that's you don't organic. Add anything? No, 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 no. no. That's, that's really yeah, good. Yeah, just really good dirt. That's, you know, good that's dirt. good. Yeah. That, that's enough. That's all yeah. that we want, actually. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's great. And how is how is your meals? What do you eat? What's 
Oh, I eat everything. You know, I try okay. to be really good. Monday through Friday, I always say I eat the best. I drink a ton of water. Every night before I go to bed, I take two bottles of water up with me. Okay. Um, water is so, 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 so important. important. That's all I drink. I have a little coffee in the morning. I wish I didn't use creamer, but I just love hazel eye creamer. It doesn't matter. Yeah. You have <laughs> um, to add something. And other than that, really, all I drink is water. Um, and then food. Again, I try to do as much as I can, you know, with just vegetables and greens, uh, proteins during the week. On the weekend, I just eat whatever I want. You know, I'm so a lover of food. Great. I love sauces, Italian sauces. So on the weekend, I do whatever. Okay. During the week, I'm good. Okay, so you have yeah. the balance through the week, and then yeah. the weekend is your break where you eat whatever, whatever. you want. And as much and whatever I want. So, okay, yeah. that's great because that means your week is your workout is compensated yeah. plus your peace of mind. Yes. You, so you have this two sides. Yeah, there. even this. though like every day is kind of the same to me because mm -hmm. I don't work very much anymore. I just always feel like Monday through Friday, that's your time for setting your goals and accomplishing them. And then on the weekend, enjoy what you've done. You know, enjoy your your success from the week. That's great, so. that's great. You are actually a good example for mind, body, heart, and soul that I have. <laughs> really, you are. I try to be. That's good. You, you accomplish it through two things, the mind and the body. Yeah. That's, yeah. that's really great. And I love that you are you have your own garden. <laughs> this is the next step. I wish everyone can have this. You know, your body will always tell you how it feels. Yeah. If you don't work out and you don't eat right, you're not going to feel good. That's the good better thing. I am, the better I am at nutrition and working out, the better I feel, the stronger I feel, the more energy. I can always tell when I fall off the wagon and I'm not eating good, I'm not drinking water. If those things happen, my body will tell me and it's, I just can't function that way. So. That's great. That, that's really great. I love it. <laughs> All right. Thank you. You're thank welcome. You so much. You're a doll. I love having you in class. Oh, You're an you. absolute doll. <laughs> thank you, too. Thanks. All right, guys. See you. Bye. <laughs> She's great, right? <laughs>